We'll check back in with you later. It is Sunday, and that means your weekly display of island talent for the Upside Sunday Showcase. Kevin, where can we find you today? Yeah, thank you, Jasmine. Today's Upside Sunday Showcase coming to you from beautiful Lanceville. Yeah, we're in a uh, backyard of the uh, performer you're about to see and listen to a little later on in the Upside. It's not just any backyard, though. It's not just any performer. It's Raymond Salgado. Do you remember Raymond Salgado? Think back about two months ago. We had Lauren Spencer Smith, you know, the Nanaimo singer who appeared on American Idol. Well, she was joined by Raymond Salgado. If you don't remember, take a look. And anyway, I something I'm giving up on you yeah today we learn about Raymond's story and he's gonna join us for an interview and a performance in just a little bit Raymond can you give us a little sample <laughs> it's the upside Sunday showcase oh yes <laughs> and we got a new theme song stay tuned the upside in just a bit Jasmine will send it back to you can we use that as our upside tune that was so great thanks Kevin The Upside is brought to you by IBEW Local 230. The pandemic has been a major struggle for many musicians, but that's not the case for the Lanceville singer featured in today's Upside Sunday Showcase, as we send things back out to Kevin Chirac. Yeah, thank you, Jasmine. We are thrilled to welcome back to the Upside Sunday Showcase, Mr. Raymond Salgado. <laughs> Raymond, thanks so Hello. much for joining us here. It's a pleasure being here today. First off, you have an absolutely outstanding <laughs> backyard, the thank Salgado you. family. This is just amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now, we had you on about uh, two months ago. You were uh, you performed a duet with yes. uh, Lauren Spencer Smith. Mm -hmm. uh, that was absolutely lovely, but we thank didn't get you. into your story too much. We talked uh, more about Lauren's. Yeah. Let's talk about your story because over the the past year and a half during the pandemic your social media has just completely exploded hasn't it uh it's it's been incredible and so insane because you know despite a lot of you know us performers not being able to perform in venues right now is so frustrating but um social media has really helped me um you know just grow with my social media and being able to like do something that i'm so passionate about yeah and put 100 percent in every day is incredible just hearing the feedback and seeing a lot of the support from all my fans so. you really see the passion in those videos and you can hear it in your voice yeah, and how you. many followers do you have now um on instagram i have 130 uh, thousand and then on my TikTok I have almost five thousand but five hundred thousand sorry <laughs> and one of those followers is Demi Lovato the yeah. major huge worldwide <laughs> global pop icon yeah. tell us how how that kind of happened how you kind of uh, caught her attention so uh, Glamour reached out to me and they told me about this segment that they were going to do with Demi Lovato where they would ask uh, singers um, that have done their covers to be featured and for Demi to react to them and so I was one of them they emailed me and I was so shocked because I grew up loving her and like listening to her on Disney and just um, it was incredible just being able to hear um, a lot of the stuff that she said and being able to pay tribute to a song that she wrote was just like out of this world stuff. So. <laughs> Pretty spectacular. You also uh, recently performed national anthem at the uh, Canucks game. Yes. And let's talk about this before you guys uh, uh, get set to perform. Mm -hmm. You uh, released a new single. Mm -hmm. um, I wrote this song and uh, me and my friend wrote this song called Almost There and he is from France and we connected on Instagram. He told me that he had this song idea and uh, just from there we worked on the song and now it's out and now you're going to perform it uh, yeah. on the Sunday Showcase. Yeah. This is, is this your first time publicly performing it? Yes. Yeah, yeah, all right. <laughs> and you're joined by uh, Alex Birch. I said you guys are going to perform. Alex Birch is going to uh, support Raymond here yes. on the acoustic guitar. Mm -hmm. So, uh, gentlemen, whenever you're ready, please Thank take you. it away. Thank you so much. I've been trying to save us. I've been trying, but you don't anymore. Finding something to hold on to Don't want to let this go Half the time we spend on stupid fights And we can't take it back, you know it And half the time we want to get it right We say we'll find the light someday 
But almost there, almost is never enough, yeah, yeah. Why you keep all the secrets? Why do you make me feel so lost? And now I don't have a spirit to put up with your ghost. And half the time we spend on stupid fights And we can't take it back, you know it And half the time we wanna get it right We say we'll find the light someday, yeah Almost there, almost is never enough We're almost there, almost is never enough and we tried and we tried to make it through all the lies And almost fell in love But almost there, yeah Almost is never enough, yeah oh. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Raymond Salgado with a little Thank help you. from uh, Alex Birch on the acoustic guitar. Thank you so much. Thank that was so outstanding. Much. Where can we find the uh, Almost There single? Where can people download you that or stream that? You just have to search up that? Almost There, and you can search up Raymond Salgado, and it'll pop up everywhere. Spotify, Apple Music, and do you have a website as well? I do not have Do not? Okay, yeah. well, search Raymond Salgado on social media. Trust me, it's a great, he's a great, great follow. That's it for us. If you've got talent, want to be on the Upside Sunday Showcase, please send us an email to the upside at checknews.ca. That's it for us, though, Jasmine. I think I'm going to go uh, try out the trampoline. Is that cool? Yes. All right. <laughs> See you guys.